The game had scarcely yet begun when Kale decided to have some fun. She extended an invite for Trind to duel, but Trindemir learned he'd been played for a fool. For the moment that he had gone in to fight, the blue team emerged from the path on his right. Then down Kale flew through the jungle, hunting, where she found an Akali, who soon began running. And once the Akali was free from concern, Talon decided that he'd like a turn. Though the reason for this we cannot discern. It is clear that we all have so much to learn. Now back in the top lane, such fun to be had. Kale starts to poke Trind and oh is he mad. In he spins and begins to strike. Kale clicks on his face and waits. What a fight. Meanwhile in bot lane, Jarvan would die. Except he didn't, much to Talon's surprise. But Brom would extend a comforting hand in the form of a brutal life-ending slam. Kale is alone? This is our chance. The purple team rallied and chose to advance. Quick, everyone chase the Kale. Oh, no, she has allies. Everyone bail. And so they ran and scurried away. But the blue team encouraged Akali to stay. She replied with some super stealth ninja tactics. Delayed for a moment, then died. Fantastic. Oh, and then Talon would meet his end. Then Akali, Trin, then Talon again. Things were not looking good for Purple, it's true. But with Jarvan's low health, they knew what to do. They jumped right upon him. This was their chance. Then everyone present danced the League Dance. Now with two champions who both soon might be dead, the question was which team might come out ahead. It was equally likely that either should die, but Jarvan didn't, much to no one's surprise. It went on like that, bad decisions and such. Talon thought he might try his luck. A tower went down, the other as well, and then Talon broke and tried to rebel. So he went and, well, you're watching it now. Miraculously, he survived somehow. Could he now execute? Had he done something right? Sleep well, dear Talon. Good dreams and good night. More of this, some of that. Suicide again. A new goal had emerged for Blue to transcend. Having just played the easiest game ever seen, they wanted to win before minute 15. And there as they stood, 18 and 0, smacking the Nexus with double the gold. It seemed they might make it, but still they were scared. And then they achieved it. Four seconds to spare. And so I say, the lesson is clear. Let this stand as a tale to all who may hear. Death is a fate which one need not adhere. If you do enough push-ups, you've nothing to fear.